New photos show exactly how a 69-year-old woman who died was found months after she disappeared. Investigators ruled there was no foul play, but Carolyn Riggins' family doesn't believe it, and they're not letting up on investigators. Fox 4's Dion Anglin is in tonight with the story. Dion. Yeah, that's right. Uh, it's been nearly a year since Regan's body was found, and uh, after a three-month-long search, these, fa these photos have her family drawing strong reactions. For it to end up in all of these uh, trees and shrubs and bushes. Newly obtained photos from the Cook County Sheriff's Department show the heavily wooded scene near Gainesville where hunters discovered Carolyn Riggins' Lincoln Town Car last October with her remains inside. It defies logic that she could have ended up out there um, even being lost or even have taken a wrong turn. It, it's not logical. Riggins' sister, Kimberly Haynes, says the pictures give her more reason to suspect the 69-year-old grandmother last seen after winning a jackpot at a Watauga bingo hall did not die of natural causes. Haynes says she's continued to have talks with Fort Worth police and Chief Neil Noakes about the case. We asked the department to respond about the interactions. Police sent a statement saying, in part, the death investigation, including the processing of the vehicle, was handled by Cook County officials. According to Cook County officials, there were no signs of foul play identified through their autopsy. That autopsy also lists Riggins' cause of death as undetermined. And we walked three miles in and three miles back out. It is rough terrain even to walk in. Amanda Coleman is a criminologist with a podcast that highlights missing persons. She's also been an advocate for Riggins family. She says she visited the Cook County scene and poured over investigation documents, including information about the contents of Riggins purse found next to her. There was candy in there. If she was starving, why didn't she eat the candy? Um, there's no evidence that she was out there walking around disoriented, scavenging for food and ultimately suffered a medical event. The things that I've reviewed indicate to me that she did not drive out there. And um, it's, I can't even convey how dark it would be. She wouldn't have been able to see. Now, Riggins' family says they continue to urge police to take a closer look at the possibility of foul play.